Hello everybody, this is Vertical Sandwich, and uh, welcome to a new LP. Uh, since the sit and run is done, so uh, we're starting a new game. And uh, again, it can't be very surprising because, uh, you know, the game, the, the video has a title, so you already know what we're doing. So, uh, But it's Final Fantasy VIII, and here we go, new game. Are you excited? I'm excited. Okay, so I'm going to say real quick, uh, in 1989, um, actually in 1989 I was... Um, 19, was it 18, 19? Uh, but I had played Final Fantasy 7 um, before Final Fantasy 8 came out, and I had actually played the demo of Final Fantasy 8, and just it looked cool. And then when I bought it and I saw this, I flipped my lid. I mean, this was the most amazing game opening I've ever seen. It's actually still um, the most amazing game opening I've ever seen. I mean, this is unbelievable. Like, you look at this, and it just looks. Gorgeous. And the cutscenes in Final Fantasy VIII are unbelievable. For PlayStation, this this is this is amazing. It's so amazing. Um, and the cutscenes look like this. I mean, actually, some of the stuff is actually parts of cutscenes. Uh, so, I mean, I, I don't know what else to say. I mean, like now you look at like the in-game stuff and like the characters moving around, and they look a little boxy, and they look like I mean, they look like PlayStation kind of graphics. But this stuff still looks beautiful. It just amazes, it, it amazes me, to this day it amazes me, and this is without a doubt, this is my favorite, um, again, my favorite game opening, uh, this is my, uh, I, I, this is my, this is my favorite, um, Final Fantasy, and, uh, people hate it, people, people either love this game or hate it, and, I'll, and, and we'll talk about that, we'll talk about why I love it, why some people hate it, it's understandable why people hate it, because the battle system in this, and the junction system is a nightmare. It's an absolute horrible headache. We'll deal with it. We'll, we'll deal with it. But um, it makes this game far too complicated. You really gotta love to play for the sake of playing. Um, but yeah, it's the draw system and the magic system and the junction system, and it's it's all nightmarish. And I get that. I get it. Um, every other Final Fantasy game is easier to play than this one, but it's also dark. It has a very dark subject matter and really crazy kind of uh, very very crazy physics based plotline that's very strange. Um, also, it was the first Final Fantasy game before ten to have adult looking characters. So if you were nineteen like me, you like and couldn't get into like the you know, darky little looking people in like seven and nine, uh, you know eight was very good. Um, I like ten and ten. I like X Men too a lot as well, but, uh, but this is uh, for me. This is the this is the B L and end all kind of of kind of Final Fantasy games. So, and I wanted to do an RPG, and I tried. Uh, I, I said this in the same because one commentary I tried to do Final Fantasy two and got a copyright claim against it for the first video. So it was just like, oh my god, wasting time. With them. Um, other people have done it on YouTube. I checked. There are there are Final Fantasy X two LPs. So. But so we'll do this. And this is beautiful. This is so beautiful. Okay. Um, so now, down to kind of technical stuff. And, and that whole the sword fight thing actually happened, and it'll play into the plot. But what I'm going to say is, uh, in this game, unlike a lot of Final Fantasy games, you can rename every character. Uh, even the um, the GFs, which are the, the, the summoning creature weapons or whatever, you can rename them. And uh, I'm going to re re rename the main character. But I'm not going to rename any of the secondary characters. Um, and um, the reason is because it'll just make it easier to kind of reference characters and stuff. If anybody else is kind of trying to reconcile this with things that they're doing or reading a walkthrough. Um, and it also helps me keep them straight in my mind if I'm doing research and I'm reading a walkthrough. So uh, we only get seven letters here. Um, so we can't fit the word vertical or the word sandwich. Uh, so I'm gonna have to think of some sort of clever thing to do. Um, well, I, you know, I don't, I don't exactly know. I don't exactly know what the, cause I'm, I'm not. I mean, I don't know. I, I just don't. Um, yeah, I don't think I want to do witch. Um, let's do switch. Uh, because then it's kind of like sandwich. It's s switch. We'll do a switch. Uh, 
and uh, then it'll be like squall. So I can remember that like when I'm reading a thing and it says something about squall, I can be like, oh, it's, it's my main character. Uh, and it also keeps us in S's. So we're opposite of Cypher, who um, is a good guy and we like him. Uh, so we want to be like him. That's why we're doing it. It has nothing to do with... Um, anyway, so, uh, yeah, anyway, uh, so we're in the hospital, and, uh, because Cypher cut our face, and now we're gonna have a scar, and, um, he was the other, he's the blonde guy who we were fighting. Um, uh, again, we're gonna, I'm not gonna run you through all the tutorials, all the stuff that we could possibly do, and we're not going through this game and trying to get everything we possibly can out of it, we're really not. We're gonna do a lot in this game. Um, we're gonna get all the GFs and stuff like that, but, uh, yeah, I'm probably like there's the, there's a card game in here, and I don't know if we're gonna like look at this stuff. This is amazing. This just looks so good. Um, this looks. I mean, because like, the Final Fantasy VII stuff looked good, but this looks great. Uh, they just outdid themselves for this game. Uh, and I just did not like, again nine like your main character has a tail and stuff, and it just it just didn't work for me. But anyway, um. I had a guy, like, I was talking about how much I like eight, and I had a guy turn to me and said, oh, I like nine better, and I was just like, ah, oh, jeez. And I, I don't know, man, I played through nine. I mean, I played through seven, eight, nine, ten, or X, X2, and twelve. Um, so, anyway. Uh, so now we'll have a conversation. where There's nothing we can really do here. We've just got to kind of run with the plot line and, and get to where we're going. So she'll walk with us and try to have a... A conversation where she finishes her sentence and stuff, the sentences, because she wants to know more about it. So look at this. She's just happy. She's beginning to understand us a little bit, you see, and like, this is, I, I'm more complex than you think. This is my relationship with every girlfriend I've ever had right here. I think I'm getting to know you, like, you don't know anything about me. I'm deep and brooding. No, that's, seriously, that's not the way I have anymore. I said anymore. Um... When I was in high school, I thought I was this guy. Uh, that helped a lot, too, that this came out, like, right after I finished high school. And I was, like, a goth kid in high school and stuff, like, um, which, uh, goth is what we called, uh, emo when I was in high school, I think. I think that's the way that works. Okay. I don't know. I don't know anything about emo or anything. But, uh, um, so, yeah, so this is the place that we're, like, staying and stuff, and, like, there were kind of scenery shots that looked good in 7, and, and again, I just think that this just blows it out of the water. But again, I, I love this game. I'm completely biased. Uh, and this is our classroom. So, uh, and that woman we just saw, her name is Quistus, I think. I'm gonna, that's, I'm, that's how I'm gonna pronounce it. Uh, she, um, she's our teacher at a school where we learn to battle monsters. Uh, for seed candidates. Um, there's also some things, like, I'm reading through some walkthroughs, because I've always just played through this game, um, and, like, everything I know about it, I've found out myself, and, like, reading through some walkthroughs, there's all these crazy things about your seed score, and, like, getting it higher and stuff, and I'll kind of direct you guys to, like, walkthroughs about that stuff, but I don't know, if, I mean, kind of the way you've got to do missions very specifically, and I don't know, I'm gonna have to look up to see what it, how it affects stuff later in the game. Uh, so she yells at Cypher for for get, almost killing us or whatever. And, uh, she lets out class and, uh, yeah. Oh, and she needs to talk to us. We're in trouble. Everybody knows that. She needs to talk to you after class like you're in trouble. So anyway, um, so yeah, she's talking to those students and, uh, we walk over, they'll apparently go away and, uh, uh we can talk to them. Uh, we can talk to anybody. I, you know, I'll be talking to a lot of people and stuff, uh, you know, just to see kind of how things go. Uh, I'm really not, I'm not going to try to take you through, like, a speed run of this game or anything. I really enjoy, uh, these kind of big RPGs. So get ready for a long ride for this, this Let's Play, because, like, I, yeah, I love this game. Um, uh, did you have a good excuse while I was in the hospital? Um, so she wants that we have to go do this thing before we can take her away or whatever. Um, uh, but we can go to the study panel and review our stuff, and that's the tutorial, and she'll be waiting at the front. Uh, so we're, we're gonna go through the tutorial, and, um, yeah, these, these like, something happened, yeah, the treppies, these people, the, the treppies, cause, like, Questus Trep is the name of our, our, uh, our instructor, so, okay, whatever, anyway, uh, I'm so jealous, maybe I, blah, 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 
And I don't think you can rename her. I think Chicha might be the only character you can't rename. Her. Uh, or maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I'm, uh, I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, certainly, so we can go sit down at her desk. And, uh, turn the power on. I like this. <laughs> Let's see. Turn the power on, or what a pain. Um, and the tutorial will, uh, Well, first it'll introduce us to the game, but it also um, introduces us to the junction system and gives us our, our first two DS. And we're not changing the names, um, although that Quetzalcoatl, that's missing a few letters to actually be the word Quetzalcoatl or the name Quetzalcoatl. So Quetzalcoatl and, and Shiva, and that actually is how you pronounce the Meso- I, I actually majored in Mesoamerican archaeology, so I know a lot about Quetzalcoatl, both the god and the culture hero. Because they're two different things. Anyway, uh, that's that completely. You're here for a let's play of Final Fantasy. You're not here for a lesson on. And so these are our button commands and stuff. And we're not going to go through all of this. I'm not going to go through all the stuff that it walks us through step by step. When we need to talk about something, like we'll talk about it. And when tutorials kind of come up and we're in tutorials, uh, we'll talk about what we need to do. It's. Um, you know, our battle stuff will be, you know, there'll be a time bar that fills up, and then when it's full, it'll give us our options. Like, that's essentially what this is saying, I'm not reading this stuff to you. Um, so, um, yeah. <sighs> and so we'll set that stuff up, and yeah, we can draw magic out of people, and that's where the whole dungeon thing comes in, and we'll be kind of talking about that, and we have special moves that will fill up as we go through battles. Um, you can pause this and read it if you have to, or something, I don't, uh, so yeah, that's, uh, that's it, so, for now, anyway, um, we don't really need icon stuff or anything like that, um, a lot of the stuff we're gonna find is really basic, potions heal you, or high potions heal you more, you know, remedies, cure status ailments, it's basic RPG stuff. If you're not familiar with RPG stuff, I don't, um, I don't really know what to say. Uh, you'll learn as we go, I guess. Uh, but we're gonna cut the video off there, and thanks for watching, and I hope this, uh, this works good, and I hope we, uh, have a lot of fun.